meeting is scheduled for next week to unlock a stalemate that has led to the delayed operationalization of the Green Park terminus in Nairobi. Faisal Ahmed has the details. It has been billed as the answer to Nairobi Central Business District's legendary congestion. But months after and three test runs, the Green Park terminus remains unoccupied. According to multiple sources we have spoken to, court cases and multiple interests have staggered the plan to launch the bus park located opposite Trailways Golf Club along Haile Selassie Avenue. Concerns to the Nairobi Metropolitan Services who will operate the bus park has also been traffic snarl-ups witnessed during the three test runs so far it has carried out which was termed as a nightmare. Green Park uh, from the word go, it was not a, a project that can solve the problem and they have done several trials, it has failed and it has exposed that uh, it will cause more traffic than uh, vehicles getting into CBD. And apparently it's under that they are not uh, confident enough to tell the authorities that uh, Green Park cannot work. And I have to go to the hospital and I have to go to the hospital. I have to go to the hospital and I have to go to the hospital. And the congestion will cease. Uh, you will see that as, as the day goes by. We are strategizing. It's not that we are even going to do it another day. Even today itself as we plan for the evening. Sources further told Citizen Televisions of plans to expand feeder roads into the park, which has also been rocked by wrangles at City Hall. The park was set up at a cost of almost 300 million shillings and was slated to be commissioned by President Uhuru Kenyatta in January this year. However, NMS has postponed the dates severally, stating various issues, including delays in construction works. NMS plans to commission several bus parks, including the Sai Road and Park Road Termini, Fig Tree Terminus, Muthurwa Terminus, Banyan Workshop Road and Green Park Terminus in its city decongestion plan. Last month, NMS asked for submissions of interest in running office spaces, shops, supermarket spaces, eateries, entertainment establishments and vehicle cleaning services in the park. The next meeting is also expected to come up with a final roadmap to launch the bus park. Faisal Ahmed, Citizen TV.